I had uh, ordered a resupply on DoorDash and then no one ever picked it up. Uh, so they were nice enough to take me into town this morning to grab food and fuel and now I'm heading out. Nice little patio area. Kitchen area in here. Back where I left off and finally started on the trail. I don't think I'll be able to do 10 miles today because it's noon and I started really late. But I'll see how far in I can get because Bennington is only 40 something miles away. Completely forgot to mention this, but I am now two thirds of the way done with the trail, which is really exciting. And soon I think I'll be three quarters. Not like soon, but soon enough, you know. think if I kiss them, I'll turn into a person. You want to kiss? Was the water here first? Or was the power line? There's three shelters between here and Stratton Mountain. Spruce Peak is the first one. I'm hoping to get between the second and third one, so I'm fairly close to the base of the mountain for tomorrow. Leaving this late in the day has made me change my plan because originally I was like, I'll get out early, uh, get to the third shelter, and then go up. Uh, but I didn't expect DoorDash and Instacart to apparently not have any drivers. Don't really understand how their system works, but that's the first time it's failed me because I've used it in other places and it's always been picked up very quickly. It's almost three o'clock. Got a couple more miles to the next shelter and I'll probably be able to get past it. The third shelter might be a little far away, but we'll see. Walking up this old road now. Not sure how far up we're going. If you're looking for Prospect Rock in the Valley Overlook, you missed it. I guess that was somewhere back there. We are splitting from the road, continuing on into the woods. I guess we were already in the woods, but... Another random metal thing in the woods. This bridge is out, which means I get to climb down to the river, try to cross it without falling in. All right, that wasn't very hard. This bridge has likely been closed for a while. Just came down here, crossed, and I'm going up. Going into the Live Brook Wilderness now, and the Douglas Shelter is 0.5 down this trail. Just ran into Lovebug going north. He um, went down to Bennington because he had to pick up his package. Uh, and then he had to hike back up to whatever this town here is. Um, and then he's going to go back to Bennington and keep going south. So I pretty far behind. Well, 30 miles isn't too far behind, but probably get even further behind on that if I take more zeros or zeros. Just off trail from the Windhall River is this nice little camping area. 
people have used it before. There's a fire ring. It's almost five o'clock, so I'm gonna stop here. Just have to find a couple good trees to set up with. I don't know if it's because of the cold weather or because my pillow has a hole in it, but it's been deflating at night and I forgot to check it when I had access to a bathtub. I'm having Annie's mac and cheese and Lay's baked potatoes for dinner. I hiked 8.6 miles today, which is pretty good. I uh, got here and got set up. Uh, now it's getting dark, as you can probably tell. Thank you for watching, commenting, donating, subscribing, and I will see you in the next one.